Good morning friends. My topic for today's lecture is BRICS. So let us talk about the BRICS. BRICS is an acronym that is used for world's leading emerging economies of Brazil, Russia, India, China and South Africa. The history of group dates back to early 2001 when the then British economist Jim O'Neill coined the term BRICS which represented the four leading emerging economies of Brazil, Russia, India and China. The group was formalized during the first foreign minister meet in 2006 and after a series of high level meetings and discussions, the first BRICS summit was organized in Yekaterinburg, Russia in 2009. In 2010, the South Africa was formally invited to join BRIC and then BRIC countries adopted the acronym BRICS. The salient features of group includes the BRIC countries brings together five leading economies which represent 41% of global population, 30% of global land, 24% of global GDP and 16% of global trade. The chairmanship of the forum is rotated annually among the member states and for the chairmanship of 2022 is being hosted by China. Let us now talk about the 14th BRICS summit. The 14th BRICS summit was annually. The 14th BRICS summit was virtually hosted by China. The BRICS country adopted the Beijing Declaration that suggests dialogues and discussions to stop Russia-Ukraine war. The BRICS countries also talked about agriculture. They also talked about terrorism. BRICS countries also discussed about the about combating the international drug trafficking and strengthening anti-corruption capacity building. Let us now talk about some of the important initiatives of BRICS. The BRICS countries highlighted many of the important initiatives. Some of the initiatives are First, launch of satellite constellation, formation of new development bank, promoting an alternative to SWIFT payment. So these are the highlighted initiatives of BRICS. Let us now talk about the challenges faced by the group. The main challenges faced by this group is being China-centric. All the countries trade with China, all the BRIC countries trade with China more than each other, which creates China's dominance among BRIC countries. China also uses its, this group to set up anti-quad agenda and also set up anti-best sentiments, which further impacts the foreign policy of many of the neutral countries of India, like India. Let us now talk about the second challenge for the group, the indifference between India and China. India and China on several issues like BRI, CPEC and geopolitical tension and the recent tensions in Ladakh creates an indifference between India and China which creates instability in the group. Let us now talk about the way forward. The way forward of this group is big countries should promote multi cooperation and promote trade diversification so that the dominance of China can be balanced. The BRIC countries should also increase the intra brick trade which our PM has formulated in 2021 BRIC summit to promote 600 billion dollar trade. Thank you.